actually he wants to take this Pyramitha thing. But if he's pulling it out here, gotta be serious, <laughs> you know? It's already losers finals. Anyway, I'm liking this skin though. Why don't more people use this Pyramitha skin? It's so crisp and clean. The red, ooh, crimson red. But all right, getting right into it here. Gorieka, you know, usually Joker player and uh, officially the best Mewtwo in the world according <laughs> to Shu stats. Uh, which, you know, it, it's sad to think about, but it kind of is true. Tor uh, Gorika also does have a Mewtwo secondary that he spams F Smash on, dash back constantly. Uh, and it works, you know? Yeah, it works. It, it does, it does. But fortunately, he's going for the Pyramither pick here. We'll see if he goes for the Mewtwo later on. <laughs> Probably not, yeah. but oh! <laughs> tries to get that read with the roll, uh, but unfortunately not going to find it just yet. And Gorika opting. For to stay on the Pyra right now. And he does seem like the type of player that would just like play a lot of Pyra over Mithra in the Pyra Mithra. But oh, damn, finding that forward. Not going to kill just yet, but Toriguru definitely looking a little scared. And oh, <laughs> bouncing off the stage. I thought almost that down air was going to hit. But was it Invul? I think it was, fortunately for him. But oh, that up going to carry up off onto the stage. And that's definitely going to kill right there. Yeah, it was really good awareness on the cross up. Yeah, definitely. That uppy is so scarily good, and I, I feel like uh, when Pyramithra just first started coming out for like six months or so, you didn't really see Pyra players use the uppy too much. But now that they know how to like uh, drag the players like up onto the platforms and things like that, it's definitely yeah. becoming one of the better uppies in the game. One of the most underrated uppies, in my opinion. Now, ooh, damn! Finding the down tilt into the up air. Gorika's looking hella clean right now. I, I didn't realize that Tori Guri on a second stock already at 118. This is looking crazy. Gorika finding the down tilt already with the two frame. Nice, finding this back throw. Going on to the Mithra. Nice dash back onto the air though. Oh, nice up air, getting off. Oh, the up smash, gonna get punished with the down tilt. This could be a really rough situation. Oh yeah. Gonna get snuffed out with that Wonder Wing. Gorika though, on a healthy stock. Ooh, finding this up air, not gonna kill just yet at 140 on Tori Guri. Finding the back air onto the Mithra. Of course, not gonna kill just yet. Ooh, finding this down smash. Oh, wow! Gonna be able to spot dodge that force smash here. Ooh, nice force side. Down smash, not gonna kill just yet. One of the weaker smash attacks on Mythos Arsenal. And ooh, unfortunately not gonna be able to get back onto the stage here. Ooh, nice. Down air. Not gonna find it though. Ooh, that's gonna be a fair bit of a combo. Nice, just run up into the grab. Gonna go with the up B here. Forward throw. Ooh, does he try and find a Gimp? Maybe. Tries to find an air. Ooh, tries to go for the call out. He <laughs> did get it, but unfortunately, not spacing it just correctly. Ooh, the Nair. Oh, oh is that going to be death? No, it isn't just yet. Gorika. Oh, <laughs> Jesus. Oh, and he just still rips another one. Gorika, famous for his F smashes, and boy, do they work. <laughs> unfortunately, Dory is going to be able to avoid those ones, but it's going to look real scary here. He's going to think twice about air dodging onto the ledge now. Ooh, nice. Oh, nice. Down tilt. Combo here. Goes for the down air. Not going to find it just yet. Ooh. Oh, he oh, just, just walks uh, up. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. He's just taking a stroll right now. Real casual. I mean, you're down a stock, buddy. You can't be playing games like this. Finding the back air. Dory Gurry all the way off stage now. Gurry air dodging back, and this is just a scary situation. Oh, the up tilt. Oh, yeah. Calling out the jump, and damn. Gurry looking, re looking real healthy. You're looking healthy as hell. Goryoka's, like, Pyramithra is, like, really scary. Because, yeah. like... He, he's not scared to like throw out like risky moves. That's true, yeah. So like you, you don't know when you're gonna be like in the threat of like dying. Yeah. I think Gorika's Pyramid was like the only Pyramid that like the nerfs actually mattered. It was like oh, the F-Smash <laughs> nerfs and stuff like that. <laughs> like, damn bro, this character sucks! <laughs> it's like, yeah, please just like nerf Nair or something or Foresight, I don't care. I, but it's still just, I, I think, I still think F Smash still is like a really good move. Yeah, definitely. It comes out hella quick and it is so big. Like you could just like <laughs> practically like edge guard sort of a little bit with it sometimes too. And uh, we saw Gorika try and go for that with the Pyro F Smash, but not going to find it just yet. Uh, maybe into this game, I'm sure we're going to see a couple more F Smashes let loose. But right now, a little bit of neutral time. Ooh, nice parry though. Finding the F Smash of Tori Guri's own. So I've told, ooh, into the grenade, ooh, into the back air, all right, ooh, finding that roll, ooh, oh, Jesus! <laughs> okay, trying to find that one, and we're trying to end him right there quick, but fortunately, Goryaka not going to get hit by it. That could have been it for him. He's going to be able to weave in through the side B. Oh, okay, <laughs> just going for a lot of side Bs here, trying to find that footstool. Fortunately, not finding it, though. I guess it goes through, like, Beeble Busters. <laughs> 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 yeah, I guess. He's, ooh, goes for the neutral B. Doesn't have anything and lag, so it just goes for the back air. Find his mark. 
Nice. Goes to the down tilt. Oh, just straight up. He's cornered and goes for the force smash. Definitely might have killed an Oh, this could be. Yeah, yeah, okay. Very unfortunate there for Gurieka. Going to be a stock down. Definitely looking a lot better than last game, but damn, that back air. I don't know if that was poor DI, but. It, it was, but like, how, can you react to it? <laughs> yeah, like, sure. Like, immediately off the angel platform, yeah. just let that rev. Like, I wouldn't either. I mean, that's a fair percent to die at as well. I mean, he was at, what, like 100 ish? No, nothing too yeah. terrible. Nothing too terrible. But it's 100 on. Oh! oh, okay. Immediately pairing it instead. Oh, finding his forward throw. Oh, my God. Does he go for the down air? He does, but unfortunately, he's got the Wonder Wing. Not going to die to these downers just yet. Oh, it goes for another down tilt. Grenade here. Tori Gurry is playing this ledge masterfully right now, but nice back air into the uppy combo. Karik is really good at hitting his. A lot. De I think the Pyro with it has definitely looked a lot better than the last time I saw this. Because he was not hitting his uppy combos like <laughs> ever. But that was like <laughs> three weeks ago. Maybe I think yeah. that was before Kagaribi. So he's definitely powered up the Pyramid since then. A lot more of a comfortable pick, and that is going to be a brutal angle on that down tilt. Didn't even need that forward air, but wanted him gone immediately. Nice. Down to the forward air. A little bit of percent here for Gorieka. Ooh, tries to find a down air. Unfortunately, going to get snuffed out by Tori Gurie's move right there. Ooh, tries to go for that nair. F tilt. Nice. Ooh, finding the back air. Wow, that's going to kill as well. Finding two <laughs> kills with the back air. The DI doesn't matter. <laughs> yeah, yeah, that, that one definitely uh, is going to kill no matter what. Ooh, nice back air. Oh, immediately goes oh. for the side B. Gorica with a side B of his own. A little bit of percent onto Gorica here. And oh, this could be scary. Oh, oh. Oh, okay, no. He barely he, makes it. Yeah, exactly. He's got the jumps on deck. But, oh, this is going to look real scary for Gorioka here. Nice air dodge on the stage. But, oh, the down tilt. This is so scary. Oh, look at the time. It just... Oh! Damn! He timed that just <laughs> well enough to go through that side B. I'm sure Gorioka was not expecting that whatsoever. Damn, I'd be pissed. I'd be pissed if I got hit by that. That's crazy. I guess the, I guess the hitbox... I mean, he clanked with it, right? Did Tori uh, clank with the side B so it got the hitbox got delayed enough that he was able to like pull through? I, I'm not I'm not sure, but like you know how like I'm pretty sure like the first part of like Pyra's like side B is like a projectile, so you can oh! like reflect it and stuff. <laughs> yeah. Oh my god, this is my favorite Goryoka character. Alright folks, we got the best Mewtwo in the world in front of us, ladies and gentlemen. Goryoka's famous Mewtwo. And we're this is such a weird like Japan losers finals. <laughs> Such a, like mid tier garbage characters that like nobody plays. It's like, yep, well, you know, we, we're local with Ken and uh, all the other really good players involved. Uh, but in the top three, we got Mitsu versus Banji Kazooie. And, you know, the, both of these players have been proven killers, so can't blame them whatsoever. Ooh, nice. Tries to go for the down tilt, but gonna get snuffed out with that high damage jab right here. That's gonna be a lot of percent. Yeah, oh, he, he just hates this grenade, though. He, he does not want to get hit by it whatsoever. <laughs> Pulling out these reflectors nonstop. Ooh, nice dash stack by Gorilla here. Opting to charge this. Ooh, oh, that down oh. smash! Wow. I think uh, Torigur tried to jump off to the ledge here, and Gorilla was able to snuff it out. But this is looking still super scary for Gorilla Mewtwo. Of course, a light character. He could definitely die at any moment to any of uh, Torigur's strong attacks here, but nice. Gonna get that down tilt into the dash stack, and ooh, the down tilt. Not going to find an air dodge, though. He's definitely trying to scout it out. Now Gorika looking comfortable as ever. He can just camp with the Shadow Balls right now. Ooh, nice. Nair into Oh, tries to go for the down air. Oh, damn. Tries to find the roll. So scary. Oh, wow. Calling out that jump. And ooh, getting that forward air. It is so scary when you're Mewtwo and you have to roll. Because that roll animation is garbage. <laughs> oh, my God. Toriko had infinite time in order to react to that. But nice job on him regardless. Nice, Gorica, being able to get that dash tag. Finding him the Nair. Ooh, trying to find the roll <laughs> in. I could definitely <laughs> spell Doom. Ooh, it's so scary. Oh, okay. Oh, that, oh wow. I, okay. <laughs> but, uh, going for the dash attack into the down tilt, down smash. And <laughs> fortunately, going to be able to get Tori Guri right there. Oh, nice. Going to be able to get that Nair off. Gorica. Ooh, he's going to burn his jump, though. Burning the air dodge. Ooh, getting that teleport. Now Tori Guri looking super nice here. Finding that grenade as well. Tries to find to the up tilt. Fortunately, a little bit too far away. Guessing the DI incorrectly there. Gorika's not going to be able to find his Nair combo. Ooh, it goes to the rapid jab. Oh, wait, he got hit into the other uh, uh, egg, so he couldn't get the combo off. That's very unfortunate. <laughs> oh, Jesus. 
He just he, he has that rifle aimed at Garika, man. He's got the patience. Oh, wait, oh, is this an up tilt? Ah. Yeah, right. The neutral get up is definitely going to get snuffed out by Turiguri here. And now we're at one stock to one stock. Again. At game three. Oh, double up tilt. Up air. Ooh, tried to fire that grenade. I'm pretty sure he wanted it on the platform. Unfortunately, not going to get it, though. Ooh, just going to get that forward air out of disadvantage. Nice forward throw. That's going to be a lot of percent here. I'm trying to find that F-Tilt. That F-Tilt is so strong. Ooh, oh, trying to reflect it. <laughs> yeah, unfortunately. Wish Banjo turned into a projectile. <laughs> but unfortunately, oh, wait, oh! Getting a Pringle Blaster combo of his own right there. Oh, not another down <laughs> smash! It. Oh, we'll try to go for the disable. He wants a kill right now. Oh! Oh, oh. oh my oh, god! That's huge. Oh, that, wait, okay. He unfortunately didn't get off of it, but damn, he tried to find a tech chase, but unfortunately just misses, and that's going to be a meaty punish on Gorika, and he's going he's gonna to get another Mewtwo win under his belt. Let's go. Let's go Gorioka. Uh, uh, yeah, I guess he's like the best Mewtwo in the world. Like God who, damn right which, he which is. Which other Mewtwo can be <laughs> pretty good? For real. No other Mewtwo can be Tori Green, man. Man, watching Gorioka and Mewtwo makes me think I want to play Mewtwo again. But then I play Mewtwo, I'm like, damn, this character sucks. Like, I'm in disadvantage. I'm like, oh my God, bro. Get me out of here. Like, I play like Mewtwo. Like, I think Mewtwo literally has like unwinnable matchups if both <laughs> players know the matchup really well at a top level. Like, no shot you're losing Mewtwo Game of Watch, bro. Or like Mewtwo Falco. <laughs>